The Central Oregon Community College Jazz Band is growing. The original band has been around for years, but they've found a new beat attracting attention. I'm Kelly Blyer, and this is Heart of the Arts on Take 5. You don't have to listen to the COCC Jazz Band for very long to know they've found their groove. Andy War is the director of the Jazz Band. He's a jazz musician from Olympia, Washington, who's lived in Bend for the last 13 years. And he's mainly a musician, playing the saxophone, flute, and piano, and composer. But he was asked to take over the COCC Jazz Band this year. I love it. It's a lot of fun. Um, I think the program here in Central Oregon has a lot of relatively untapped potential to become a really respected jazz program, a lot like the bands, for example, at Mount Hood Community College, which is known for its great jazz program and its jazz festival that it does. And I'd like to see COCC build into something similar to that. Well, the most recent interest in expanding the program came when they approved um, funding for a second band and are supporting a second big band uh, jazz class and that's a first step the college also offers several jazz combo classes and um, other similar classes and, and that's that's all part of building the program and i'm just hoping over the years uh, and in the not too distant future that the uh, program continues to pick up speed and, and we're getting closer to uh, yeah to a larger and uh, more well-known program in the state. Brad Baird joined the COCC Jazz Band six years ago. Um, it just was kind of happenstance. Um, I, they needed uh, an alto player one night. They were short, so I just uh, I was in the band before this. So I stayed, sat in, and uh, the director at that time said, wow, you know, would you be available? And so when an opening came up, it was a couple of terms later, then I became a permanent member. I've played alto. I started on alto. I played since third grade and just was raised in uh, music on the side. Always did it and really enjoyed it as part of me, so I just never gave it up. I'm still I'm 44 years old, still playing. By day, Brad runs a funeral home here in Bend, but at night... Work kind of gets takes over a lot of my life, but uh, this is my... Uh, this is my... Uh, my real passion, my escape, yeah. 70-year-old Cliff Robeson joined the band a couple years ago. I played a lot, uh, both jazz and classical, in in high school. But that was in the 50s, and uh, a little bit during college. And then I basically stopped playing other than just uh, once in a great while getting an instrument out for half an hour or something for about 40 years. And then I took it up again. And uh, uh, I've always loved jazz. And, oh, it's just a huge charge to play with a group and hear this sound all around you and, and play in an ensemble and once in a while get a solo. And Director Andy War is optimistic about the jazz talent in Central Oregon. There is a fairly large community of musicians here in Bend, and a lot of them, uh, well, there's a real range. A lot of them are relatively older musicians who play in some other community concert bands and whatnot. Some are younger players who are taking music courses at the college already. There's a few very good high school musicians who are participating as well. So we really have a broad spectrum of backgrounds and experience. Um, but it's, it's almost like an empty palette. You know, a lot of them are coming to jazz for the first time playing in a jazz big band. And in a lot of ways, that's really great because they don't have a lot of preconceptions. Kelly Blyer, Heart of the Arts is a production of KBND. Depend on us.